Alright, this video is a very simple way to install uh, the newest version of Ardour, 32-bit uh, 4.6.0 on Ubuntu Linux, uh, which I'm running 14.04. Um, I'm making this video because there was no um, clear explanation on the internet, or video rather, of how to install it. It's not that hard. It's just that um, a lot of people seem to assume that newbies will know what certain things mean um, and not make mistakes. And that's not the case with Ubuntu. I'm, it's, it's not user friendly when it comes to installing certain things. So uh, I figured I'd make this video because it was very nerve wracking for me to nail down what I was doing wrong. Um, and it seems simple enough. <clears throat> so. Step one, um, you're going to want to go to Ardour and download it. And after you've downloaded it, um, and I recommend you know donating the dollar or whatever, uh, or however much money you want <clears throat> to get you know the full version and everything. But uh, once you've done all of that, um, next it says how to install here. As you can see right here. CD slash folder where you save the file. And then it says slash bin slash sh and then space dot slash downloaded file name, which obviously you would replace with whatever it was. You don't type all that in at once. I'll show you the steps. Um, Okay, here's a screenshot. So for me, after you've downloaded the file and it's in your downloads, right here. Okay, that's what it's called. And if you really want to see what the path is, you can right click, go to properties, and it's right here, location. There it is. That's where it is located. So that's what you need to remember. Slash home and then whatever your file or your username is, and then downloads. Okay, and then so here, uh, when you bring up terminal, which if you don't know where that is, you can go up to uh, here and just type in terminal and it'll, you'll see it. Uh, and then you type in cd space slash home slash whatever your user is, and then slash downloads. Let's see, here I purposely spelt it with a lowercase d, and it says um, no such file or directory. So it is very case sensitive. You have to get it exactly right. Any time that there's a capital, has to be a capital, uh, that type of thing. So uh, once you spell it right, this is what comes up, a new directory line. Okay, and then the next thing that you do, there's two things you can do. Like what they said here, if you type that uh, verbatim, slash bin, slash sh, space, um, dot, slash, and then this exact thing, underscore, dash mark, 4.6.0, dot, run, it'll start. Or, the way I got it to go. Um, right here. If you type chmod space plus x space and then again the file name exactly, it goes. It'll fire up for you and install. Alright, that's it for this video. Uh, my next video I'm going to make here, I'll explain how to get uh, MIDI working because that was rather frustrating for me as well.